everybody, this is um, a short video about working out the population number of bacterial cells or the growth of uh, the rate of bacterial cells. So this question is an exam question related to uh, Messelson and Stahl, and it uh, is looking at um, heavy isotopes of nitrogen, and then it talks about the investigation the scientist measured the size of the population of bacterial cells so that's what i'm interested in so what we've got to do it tells you the generation time for a population of bacteria is the time taken for all the bacteria to divide once by binary fission and it says use figure one and they give you the equation the following equation to calculate the generation time for this population of bacteria give your answer in hours now, um, obviously, they give you the equation, which is great. But what's not so obvious is how to use your calculator. And this is one of the problems that my A-level students found. So I thought it'd be useful to uh, show you how to do this uh, question on your calculator. So first of all, we need to find the size of the population at time plus four and the size of population at time minus four. So let's have a look at the graph. So first of all, plus four hours. There we go. And you can see that the answer is either it's three times 10 to the nine. So 10 to the nine, so that's one, two, three, or it's 10 to the 9.3. And I'm gonna use 10 to the 9.3. So I just think it's easier on a calculator uh, to work out the answer. So, population of minus four let's have a look so minus four and we go up and you can see it's one two three four ten to the six point four or four times ten to the six so first of all we need to divide ten to the nine point three divided by ten to the six point four so i'm gonna so here we have a ClassWiz uh, calculator. Most students have this type of calculator. Uh, you can use any type of calculator, though they all have the same features. So um, I'm just going to extend it. There you go. Right, so let's feed it in. So what we've got to do is we've got to use the shift button. And then do you see the 10 there, 10 to the 9.3 divided by shift 10 to the 6.4 okay and that gives you 794.328 so now we need to times it by log 10 so let's just um go to the log 10 so log 10 and then use that button and it's 794 0.328 and that gives us 2.89 recurring and then we need to divide it by log 10 to the base 2 so divide that should give us the answer okay which is 9.633 okay so 9.633 is basically um, a generation but it says what is the generation time so use the following equation to calculate the generation time for this population of bacteria. So what we've got to do is look at the number of hours. Well, it's actually eight hours. OK, so you minus four to four. So that is eight hours. So that's eight. So what you have to do is eight divided by nine point six three three. And that gives us the answer. Nor point eight three. So there we go. Generation time in hours is 0.83. Hope you found that useful. Um, there are going to be more maths based questions coming for biology, as I know many of our students in A-level struggle with these. Um, but it's really just getting to know your calculator a bit. And uh, yeah, so I hope you found that useful. I'll see you soon.